Hey, what's up YouTube? Intergalactic here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys a FL Sun V400 that I have taken apart and I'm going to be attempting to reassemble. As you can see, it's right here. And uh, it is in pieces, guys. Um, I had snapped off a nozzle. So this nozzle right here, um, it's completely snapped. So I, I over tightened it and just snapped the nozzle right off in the hot end. And this is the old hot end. It's actually still in there. Um, as far as I know, there's really no way to extract that broken piece of nozzle. So FL Sun sent me a new hot end assembly. First step is I'm going to install this heating element and thermocouple into the heating block. The heating block or heating element is seated. Just tightening down the set screw. So it's tight. And now for the thermocouple. Okay, so for this next part of the assembly, I am taking these long, skinny uh, Allen, Allen screws and running them through this small piece of uh, um, just looks like tubing almost. And I'm going to use those two attachment points to attach heat block to the frame. This goes through here, but only after it goes through the heating block. It goes on like that. I'm encountering another problem here and I just wanted to show you guys. So as you can see, this, uh, this copper heat break is really close to the plate. And that's so close, in fact, that I cannot fit this ex uh, extruder assembly, fan shroud assembly, onto, fully onto the heat break. So what I think I have to do is flip the heat block all the way around to 180. I'll report back. Um, as you can see, that definitely corrected the problem. Um, there's plenty of space all the way around the, the heat break at this point. So I'm just going to go ahead and clip this on. And that should fit. should fit on there pretty good. I have been impressed with FL Sun's V400, um, especially with the clipper. Um, Clipper has just been a game changer for me, and uh, I've really been able to get the most of my printers. Go right through the middle here. So there is a tiny set screw in there, and I think I'm tightening it. Yes, it's definitely getting tight. Okay, there it is. Should be able to fit the actual extruder assembly on now, which looks like this. Okay, that fits quite nicely. I should be able to screw the extruder assembly down. Notice it is threaded, so I should be able to get a uh, screw through this plate. All 
All right, guys, last screw for the fan shroud. There it is. You just need to attach the piece of PTFE at this top location here, and then reassemble this top. Uh, filament runout detector and at that point uh, this should be ready to go all right guys there you have it um, the FL Sun V400 hot end reassembly and just to show you guys I'll extrude a little bit here you can see it's uh, it's working. Really nice of FL Sun to send me a new hot end assembly and um, it's working great. So thank you guys for watching.